Hi, this is a hair tutorial video for the classic bow font updo. You'll need you'll need a small section of the hair from the top, two at the front, two there, which are going to be at the sides. You just make sure you keep the back in a pigtail. So first of all, we're going to start with this. using a backcombing brush you're going to backcomb it all you're backcombing all of this as well So it basically looks like a mess when you finish with it. So you've got all that. And you're gonna, I think I'm gonna back home it a bit more. I want it like a proper stuffing. Because this is stuff in the bow font. You might want to straighten your hair before you do this hairstyle as well. Because once you've done the bow font, it's hard to straighten without it pulling on it. So you're going to barrel curl that bit from the back. And you're going to clip it in using Kirby Grips. It's important you get this bit right. Keep it in tightly, make sure it's secure. So it's like that. I think I'm going to get a few more clips though. Because I want it to be tight so it doesn't feel like it's going to fall. Right, you're going to undo this section and undo this section and you're leaving the front two like that. I'm going to take a small section maybe a bit too thick that one and take a small section use the back combing brush again just you lightly back comb this you need to make sure you get it all as well a bit from this side back on this again remember to keep these in the clips This hairstyle's worth spending a long time on if you want to make it look really nice. You can see it's falling on the barrel curl. 
won't look this messy when it's done. Missed a bit out there. Not can fall anywhere. You want to pull it behind and let it rest on top, maybe push it up a bit. Get a Kirby grip. That's my mum laughing if you can hear her. She's talking to Siri on the iPhone. She's a bit daft. And you get this. And it only takes a couple of clips at the back. I'm going to use one more. I'm going to pull it out a bit because it's bugging me well, that's the bow font you want to take these two out you can do whatever you like with these I usually plot them. I usually do that though on younger people. Looks nice whatever age though, but I'm going to twist it like so. And I'm going to clip them in. Yeah, I might want to use her clips that are the similar colour to her. the right colour. Right. Now you're going to take the bubble heat. Let's put this to the side. Hey YouTube. And that is how to do the ball font. Thanks for watching.